Hey guys. Um, I know I look horrible right now. My concealer and powder is cakey. I can't do anything about that. I've tried. My eye makeup is smeared and looking terrible. My hair is messy and just up in braids like this. And this is what I'm wearing. I look horrible, I know. But anyway. Um, last month, my brother had told me that Andy Black was coming to Greensboro, North Carolina to the Blind Tiger out at Spring Garden Street, which is a bar. We got tickets. Me and my friend went to see Andy Black. He was coming uh, for his, um, I believe it's called... Uh, Ghost of America, the Ghost of America tour of 2019 of his, and he was singing all the songs from his new album, The Ghost of Ohio, which if you guys have never heard any of the songs from that album, do check it out, because it's an amazing album. That, and check out the uh, songs from his, uh, al his older album, The Shadow Side, amazing album, I gotta get both of them, um, but yeah. Um, we got there, waited in line, it was freezing cold. Um, now he had a meet and greet, but the only way to get to meet him is to have a VIP pass, and I, that was a hundred bucks, so I couldn't afford it. I didn't get to meet him, no, which is okay. But, we got in, I was gonna get a shirt, but the shirts weren't, they didn't have any for 25, only 30, 40, and the hoodies were 50, so I just got me and my sister a tour poster of his. Now my tour poster is hanging up on my door in my room. Um, so yeah. Um, but they had two bands that come out before Andy. And they saved the best for last. The other two bands were really good. I enjoyed them. Um, then Andy come out. The lights, they changed his, they changed his, they changed the background, had his banner out. The drum set that said Andy Black on it. Lights went out. His bass player and drummer come on stage, and then Andy did, and we were all freaking, freaking out and screaming in the crowd. We were chanting Andy, 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 over and over again. And he starts performing, and I am like so excited because I've been wanting to see him. I want, he had come to Arizona Pete's, which was a bar, which is a bar here in Greensboro a couple years ago, and I couldn't go. Um, but I got to meet Andy. I mean, bleh. why do I keep saying I got to meet? I did not meet him. I got to see him live. I'm sorry, you guys. I am an, I am a complete idiot right now. Get it right, you idiot. Um, but, yeah. <clears throat> so, he finished, he sung all the songs from his album, The Ghost of Ohio. And, so, the lights went out. Now, he said... I believe the last song he sung was that he he said last song, the Ghost of Ohio, and he sung that and then after that left the stage for a little bit, a few minutes. So we were all chanting in the crowd, one more song, one more song, and then chanting Andy's name over and over. They they come back out on stage, and he sung the song We Don't Have to Dance, which is. One of his biggest hits right now, which is on the album, on his uh, his uh, older album, The Shadow Side, which, if you guys have not heard uh, heard the songs from that album, I do recommend you check that out, because you will not be disappointed. Um, but it was amazing. I literally, while he was performing We Don't Have to Dance, I'm sitting there crying, because I am just so excited and happy that I got to see him. And I had pretty good seats. Um, I was screaming my head off with the rest of the rest of the crowd, and <clears throat> sorry. And it was amazing. So after the show was over, <clears throat> after he finished performing, we don't have to dance. I screamed out, "I love you, Andy." Let's see. I've always wanted to do that. Um, I've always wanted to go to a concert like this and scream that out to one of my favorite uh, musicians, and I finally got to do it. It was a great, it was great, it was a great show. I, I, I'm sorry I keep stuttering. I'm sorry. I'm very sorry. Um, 
it was amazing. After that was done, show was done. Um, they went, Andy went off the stage and went through a door, you know, I guess the back door to get out, outside to the back. And um, I saw Andy's bass player standing at the side of the stage and my friend saw him. My friend looked at me, he said, go over there. So I walked over there and I asked Andy's bass player, I said, excuse me, could I get my picture with you? And he was so nice. He was extremely nice. He said, yeah, sure. So my friend took my picture with him. Um, amazing. After we were leaving out, the lead singer to the second band that had come out. Now, I don't remember the, the first and second band's name. I'm sorry. Um, but as we were leaving out, the lead singer to the second band was signing autographs and taking pictures. So I got my picture made with him. And I took my best friend's picture with the lead singer to the second band as well. And, um, yeah. It was a great show. Now, if you want to see the pictures and the videos from the concert, follow me on Instagram. Type in my username, Paranoia Destroyer one That is Paranoia Destroyer one Um, I won... My DMs are always open, but if you message me, no sexual harassment, no bullying, no threats, no asking for X-rated pictures, because if you ask me for all that kind of stuff, I will report you, I will block you, um, but just no asking for that. Um, but I guess that that's it, I guess. Um, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Give this video a big thumbs up if you liked it and if I should do more videos like this. Comment in the uh, comment section below and tell me what you think of Andy's new album, The Ghost of Ohio. Um, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.